hard work. Hard work. It's 98 degrees outside. Well, that guy's in the AC. Those guys are not, right? Why are we talking about this right now? Because it's critical. We're entrepreneurs. We're business owners. We decide what we want to get done. We have a vision to fulfill. We've got something that we're working towards that we're looking to accomplish and we need other people to get it done, right? We need buyers, we need sellers, we need other people that are doing something. Now, the reason we're sitting right here is Taylor and I were just chatting about kind of some life things. And here's a raw truth that a lot of people are forgetting about. You either have a primary aim that's exciting that you're working to fulfill or you're working to fulfill somebody else's. Now, this group of guys and girls here right now working, they're fulfilling a little of both perhaps, but more so they're fulfilling the guy who had the vision's primary aim on this project, right? The vision was what can we, think about the risk. Here's a piece of dirt. I've got a vision to make my life better, to create more income, to do more things so I can experience more things and take care of those that I love and improve the community and have some fun and make some money, right? It all starts with that idea. So that idea was, okay, how do we do that? How do we get the land? Where do we get all the money for the land? Where's the architecture? Where's the city approvals? How do we work through that process? How do we deal with the lawsuits that come with it? How do you deal with the aggravation? How do you want to deal with the aggravation? What's it at the end of the day and does that work, right? And this particular case, this is 2022. The approvals here started in 2016, right? One and a half million dollars in legal fees, right? For because some douchebag over there, sorry, beep, right? Didn't want to see anything get built here. So he wanted to file a lawsuit to delay things. So he delayed things, cost a bunch of money, but it's still being built. So whatever, congratulations. But you got to go through all of that stuff for whatever's in the end of the day, right? So now we're to the stage where the vision was made, everything was created, everything was designed. Now we have to tell people about it. Now we have to sell our vision to other people. So they buy it, literally buy it. And in this case, they're $1.3 million visions which we're selling the lifestyle, the proximity, the area, the community, the safety, the features, the security, the everything, right? That rolls into the whole process. And now we've got 21 out of 27 of these sold to visionaries who are fulfilling their own vision because they're picturing themselves and their families and their loved ones sitting on the back deck, having a little martini, watching the sunset, life is good, right? So that's all in place. Now, someone's gotta do it. Who's digging the hole, right? Not the guy that had the vision. Right? The guy's digging the hole is fulfilling his vision right now, which is probably not as grand at the moment. But he has a choice. You have a choice. I have a choice to think bigger, right? Think bigger. So we have to make sure we're either, we're very, we need to be very clear on this. You're either fulfilling your primary aim or you're fulfilling somebody else's, right? And none of us got into this industry to really fulfill somebody else's. And so this is the reminder to dust yours off to get a little bit more clear as far as what lifestyle are you looking to be living? How much income is that gonna to require to fund? And then what action steps are we putting into place to talk to people to find the right dot to connect to make that thing happen, right? There's a lot of dots connected to be at this stage where we are right now, there are tens of thousands of dots that have been connected, all because there was a vision, right? There was a need, there was a why, there was some passion, there was some resilience, there was mental preparation there was toughness, there was financing, there was the, the ability to get ready for a true battle, right? To make this happen for fun, right? And to have fun and to make money. So here's the call to action right now. Fire up your primary aim. Get clear on what it is. Every market is perfect. Perfectly set up for those who want to listen to the market and what it's telling you and are willing to take the steps to talk to the people that are buying and selling in the market that you're in right now, right? That's the key. There's always money. There's always buyers. There's always sellers. And those who have a vision will always find them. Those who do not have a vision will find excuses, right? So your choice right now is, it's a real choice. Vision or be part of somebody else's. Because if you're not working on your vision and you're not fired up about your vision right now, and you don't, you're not taking the steps to talk to people to make that come true, you're going to have no choice but to go get another job to work for somebody else to help their vision come through. And that's not what you got in this business for. That's not what you told yourself. That's not what you told your family. That's not what you told your kids. And if you end up that way, it is your fault, right? More tough love.
but I'm doing this because we're all part of the same thing, guys. And it's not easy right now. I know it's not easy right now, right? But what time did you get up? What time did you go to bed? And what did you do yesterday? I got up damn early. I stayed up way late and I'm working my ass off way more than I used to, too, because the market requires us to do more just to have what we had last time and last year, right? So markets change, they go up and down. Always opportunity, are you finding it? Please make sure your primary aim is clear. If you need help polishing yours up, you need help figuring out what it is, reach out to any of us. We're always here to help, that's what we do. It's empower, educate, and encourage. That's the whole thing behind BE3, and that's what we're here to do for you guys. So wake up, fine tune it, clarify your goals, and make stuff happen, guys. You deserve it, and you know you do make it work.